So when I was 12 years old, they found a bone infection in my right heel. They put me in isolation and I was in there for three weeks. And so they said if I hadn't come like two or three days earlier that the bone infection would have spread to my heart and I would have died. My dad gave me a camera. He gave me his Canon AE-1 and I became obsessed with photographing the doctors and the nurses, everyone who came in or what I was going through. I just wanted to be able to show people my point of view and what I saw and what I was going through. And so that's when it first, photography first became real to me. You know, in high school, they give you all this pressure to pick a career, to be this doctor, be this lawyer, go to college, you have this one path. But I think it's so much more important to develop who you are. A photograph is really, really personal. It's invasive, it's humbling. And I think that in order to photograph somebody's real soul and their real emotions and what they're really all about, I feel like that has to come from me also. If I want them to show me how they really are, then I have to show them how I really am. I thank my parents every day for raising me the way that they did because I believe in myself so much. I'm my own biggest fan. I really think that I could do whatever I wanted to do and it's because I love myself and I know what I'm capable of.